this demonstration, we're going to use uh, orange fluorescent paint, water-based paint, and spray with electrostatics in pallet of cardboard boxes to show you the coverage that we can get not only on the outside, but the boxes on the inside. Okay, these were the boxes that were on the pallet, and uh, you can see some of the orange coating, and we only sprayed just for a few seconds, if you remember. So what we're going to do is turn out the lights, then turn on the black light, and show you the coverage, coverage we got on the back side of these boxes. Now you can see the coverage. Uniform coating. So let's open them up on the inside and show you what we had, the kind of coverage we had on the inside of the boxes. Mm. Can you see the coating we had? This was on the inside of the boxes. Alright, so let's take this. Turn this one around and show the coverage we had here. Still uniform coating. What was able to do? This one here. Coating. Turn this one all the way around. You see that it was getting coating all the way around the boxes. Oh, we even got it where it went under the between the boxes. What we have is the actual pallet itself. And you can see where the boxes were laying tight uh, against the pallet. But you can look inside and see the coating that we got that was under the pallet. We got a uniform coating under the pallet back there move further down and we'll look in from the end we got beautiful coat and covering come around here and can you see the coating that we got under the pallet does that show up it does that way mm-hmm it totally does mm -hmm. we're gonna have to mm -hmm. all the way down here show that This demonstration that we were doing with the orange dye and the cardboard boxes, I found this box that had another box close, very close to this side. And you can see the outline of where the box was. And if you look at this spot with the naked eye, it does not look like we had any of the orange uh, paint spray there. So that's why it's very important to use the black light, but you want to use the black light in a dark room so you can actually show the coverage that we have here. So what I'm going to do is turn the lights out and then use the black light, but I'm also going to use a Q-tip to show that we did get coverage on this spot here in the center. All right, so the first thing I'm going to do is use this Q-tip to show, let me rub it here, to show that there is, if this is show up, 
that there is the orange dye there. Does that show up? Okay. Now we'll turn uh, the lights out and turn the black light on. Okay. Now you can see that we do have complete coverage over this spot by using the black light. Then, if you can tell where I used, you can see where I used the Q-tip. Not only does it show on the end of the Q-tip, but you can see the spot where I wiped it out. 